Can you honestly tell me that in your experience that um, which we experience is for our growth? Yes. Yes. I don't feel that this universe is vindictive. I think it is corrective. It offers you innumerable opportunities to somehow to step up to higher ground. If there seems to be punishment, then even that is an action of grace, which at the time we don't appreciate. Often you are saying thank you to the wrong guy, <laughs> to what makes you feel sweet in the moment. You say thank you for your chocolate flavored moments. But some things rub and squeeze and grind you that you don't say thank you for. But they alter your being in such a way that it brings wisdom into your experience, you see. And rarely we are thankful for that. Someone once asked me, not long ago, in fact, uh, some friends are here too. We were just in, in Spain just now. And one man came and asked the interpreter next to me, Ask Muji if he will give me a mantra. <laughs> Can you give me a mantra, Muji? <laughs> why did he want? Why did he want a mantra? Why did you want a mantra? I don't want a. Ma I don't want a mantra. No, no, wait, wait. No, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so, I said to him, I shall tell you the best mantra, the universal mantra, the best mantra any being can say. Not just Indians. A mantra for every being. Your mantra is, thank you. Just keep saying, thank you. Don't explain. Don't complain. Just say, thank you. Say, thank you to existence. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Muchas gracias. <laughs> Merci beaucoup. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You don't have to justify it. And somehow your beingness comes alive. It's cleaned somehow. Every being, everyone who comes into your life, if you don't understand what they bring, you still say thank you. Just thank you. They kick you. You may not say thank you immediately. <laughs> but somewhere inside you, you say thank you. Just like this. See what happened. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you.